Okay, you may not even be able to hear me over this noise, but you can see what the wind is doing today. I just wanted to document this. I'm going to keep this one short. But uh, there's my boat out there in this, fighting this wind. And uh, I had a few operator errors today. Fresh batteries. I got a fresh uh, servo on the rudder of the Tabo 3004. The uh, the uh, biggest sail servo that Tabo makes isn't quite strong enough to handle this kind of wind, so I have to just kind of work with it. But uh, still, pretty. She's she's holding up pretty well. Um, a couple times I thought she was throwing up a rooster tail. Um, but uh, the sun's just come out. It's been kind of overcast and windy. And of course, I don't have my truck on, so it might be a little shaky. Uh, the wind's coming in about the direction the camera's facing right now. So I'm trying to drive with the left hand and uh, hold the camera with the right. So if I'm a little shaky, that's, that's me. It's not the boat. But uh, they were trying to get her downwind. So, and uh, for all you people that say that this boat can't handle high winds, I give you high winds. This is a small craft advisory, folks. Oops, wrong way. Oh well. Break for a second. And we're back. All ashore, they're going ashore. Okay, let's see what she does on attack. Attacking is a lot of fun in this kind of wind. I'd say I, I don't have a wind meter or anything, and I haven't checked Wind Guru yet. I will later. I'll post what the wind speed was. But I would say it's a good 18 to 20 sustained by four gusts. It's up to four gusts. It's under 75 miles an hour. We're okay. Sunday, um, November 8th, I believe. I usually get the date wrong. If it is, I'll correct it. But, uh, there she goes. She's tacking. In fact, earlier when I went to uh, get the camera, went to my truck to get the camera, this boat actually fought her way upwind all the way over to. You see that dock right there? She fought her way all the way. Without me even touching the uh, radio, she just kept going upwind and uh, made it all the way over to the And in fact, I had to unstick her when I got back here. Um, but uh, it's a tough little boat. And then as soon as I turn off the camera, she starts responding beautifully. So, here we go. We're going to complete this tack. You can see that cat's ball coming up. Tell you, man, these gusts are quick. The wind itself is, is, you know, sustainable. But the gusts are quick. So, I think I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna bring her about, bring her back. See, this wind is so tough that the, the sails. More than the uh, rudder. Well, there she is moving along nicely. My left thumb, and not so much. Okay, there we go. Seems like the breeze has died down, but it has not. I tell you, it has not. Okay, let's see. Okay. Alright, I'll do one more pass by and then that'll be it. So, 
So I hope you guys uh, are out sailing today. It's Sunday. It's a good day to sail. Well, maybe not if you're stuck up in Michigan like where I'm from. It might be a good day for ice boating. But uh, there she is. Solera. Still white sails. I'll get some numbers on her someday. Okay, much better. Okay, I reset the mast. Got my cigar relit. Set the break the mast back, and now it seems to handle a lot better. Uh, wind is still rocking. It's about uh, 5 o'clock in the afternoon right now. Not much daylight left. Um, but still really overcast. And, uh, Oh, look, she's, she's cruising along real well now. So, uh, I'm not fighting as much. And there she goes. I'm going to have to drive the boat through the camera or watch the boat and let it go out of the camera frame. So uh, here we go, I'm going to come about and try to do a little tacking. Uh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Okay. Try to tack a little bit. Bring it up close. And, oops, wrong way. Wrong thumb. Okay. I'm telling you, this wind is rocky. I'm not joking. Big old Muscovy. Okay. Back to our. Um, that's a duck, by the way, for anybody who's not from South Florida. It's one of the ugliest ducks you'll ever see. She's handling a lot better now than she was before. In fact, I was going to delete that other film, but now that I've mentioned it, I guess I better include it. So this is part of the trials and tribulations of uh, Frog Soda and Solera. So, uh, I got a huge cat. See, I turned the other way. I got a huge cat. I would love to crew one of these boats, so if anybody owns one and uh, would like to invite me along, I'd be happy to give it a shot. I've never been sailing for real before. I'm only sitting on a milk crate. That main cell quit flapping, but and there she goes. So you take it easy. Here I go. 